Imagine a world where the line between life and death is guarded by a deity with the head of a jackal, a figure so revered and feared that he became the gatekeeper of the afterlife. Welcome to the realm of Anubis, the ancient Egyptian god of the dead. As we uncover more about this enigmatic deity, we gain deeper insights into the world of ancient Egypt and its rich mythology. Anubis continues to remind us of the mysteries that lie beyond this life and the eternal journey of the soul. Anubis, one of the most iconic gods in Egyptian mythology, played a crucial role in the journey of the soul. His black jackal head is instantly recognizable, a symbol of protection and mummification. But who was Anubis, and why was he so important to the Egyptians? What secrets does he hold about the afterlife? In this video, we will delve deep into the history, mythology, and modern-day influence of Anubis, unraveling the mysteries of this ancient deity. Anubis, known as Inpu in ancient Egyptian, first appeared in texts during the Old Kingdom, around 2686 to 2181 BCE. Initially, he was considered the principal god of the dead, overseeing the embalming process and guiding souls to the afterlife. The origins of Anubis are deeply rooted in the ancient Egyptian belief system. As time progressed, his role evolved. By the Middle Kingdom, Anubis was overshadowed by Osiris, who became the chief god of the dead. However, Anubis retained a significant role as the protector of graves and a guide to the afterlife. Anubis was often depicted as a black canine or a man with a canine head. The black color symbolized the color of mummified flesh and the fertile soil of the Nile, associating him with both death and rebirth. Anubis is perhaps best known for his role in the weighing of the heart ceremony. In the Hall of Ma'at, the deceased's heart was weighed against the feather of Ma'at, the goddess of truth and justice. As the guardian of this sacred ritual, Anubis ensured that the scales were balanced and fair. If the heart was lighter than the feather, the soul was deemed worthy of entering the afterlife. If heavier, it was devoured by the fearsome Amit. Anubis is closely associated with several symbols, the most prominent being the jackal, which represents his role as a protector of graves and a guide for the dead. He is also depicted with a flail, a symbol of authority and protection, and the Ankh, representing life and resurrection. Anubis's influence extends far beyond ancient Egypt. In modern culture, he appears in various forms of media, from movies like The Mummy to TV shows such as Stargate SG-1. His iconic image continues to captivate and inspire. Artists and writers draw upon Anubis's mysterious and powerful image, using him to symbolize protection, the unknown, and the afterlife. His enduring presence in popular culture reflects our ongoing fascination with ancient mythology and the mysteries of death and the afterlife. Anubis, the guardian of the dead, remains a powerful figure in both ancient and modern imaginations. His role as the protector of souls and guide to the afterlife highlights the ancient Egyptians' profound beliefs about life, death, and rebirth. So what secrets does Anubis hold about the afterlife? As the deity who presides over the weighing of the heart, Anubis teaches us that death is not an end, but a transition to another realm, where one's actions in life determine their fate in the world beyond. This profound belief underscores the importance of morality and justice in the journey of the soul. Thank you for joining us on this journey into the world of Anubis, the mysterious guardian of the afterlife. If you enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up and share it with others who love ancient mysteries and mythology. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel and hit the bell icon so you never miss an update on our latest explorations into the fascinating stories of the past. Leave a comment below and let us know what other topics you'd like us to cover. Until next time, keep exploring the wonders of history.